All right, man, we back. Y'all see the title, man. I got the best intro in the world. <laughs> um, Detachment. So I think people get detachment. Uh, I think we get I think we get it wrong. You know what I'm saying? I think we think that detachment means that you don't care about anything. You don't care about anybody. You don't care about anything. You just don't give a fuck, right? And that's true and also not true. To me, what detachment is having the ability to see things for what they are and not what you want them to be, you know, not putting your emotions, not putting your biases into uh, what you see outside of yourself. You know what I'm saying? Like, I feel like when you truly start to learn and implement detachment into your life, you actually start to appreciate and love things even more because you're able to see things clearly as opposed to, you know, seeing a person, place or thing and attaching all your emotions to it and then appreciating it because of those emotions when realistically you're selling yourself short by not seeing it for what it is holistically um, by taking all that away from it. You know what I'm saying? Because without what you think and feel about something, it's probably more beautiful because putting your biases and your emotions on things, it's it's blinding. You know what I'm saying? Because you're choosing to see certain things. So when you learn how to actually detach, it's not, oh, you don't care about anything or you don't care about anybody and you just don't give a fuck. It's like, no, I understand it for what it is. I see the good aspects. I see the bad aspects. But at the same time, I'm not looking at it through that lens of just those two things. I'm really looking at it as a whole because everything has pros and cons. Everything has dark and light. And that's just life. You know what I'm saying? Everything is like that. Nothing is perfect. And when you understand that it makes things so much easier, you get less emotional, you get less attached to things and people and, and, and situations and stuff like that and feelings and stuff like that. You start to slowly remove those. It's almost like they're like, um, they're like, they're like strings. It's like those strings start to start to detach themselves and then you kind of see it for what it actually is and you really get to see the beauty in that person place or thing or whatever it is you know what i'm saying you start to actually get to see those things because you're not blinding yourself because you're seeing what you want to see or you're seeing what you don't want to see or you worried about what you don't like about it or you know what i'm saying like you're getting rid of all this i i i i i all this selfish uh all these selfish things you're starting to remove those things and just see it you look at it it's like when you meditate you know what i'm saying when you meditate you watch you watch your thoughts just go by you don't judge them you don't say anything about them you don't you don't uh put them in a category of if it was a good thought it was a bad thought you just see it and it goes it's like when you're sitting outside and you're watching the cars go by you just watch the car go by that's it you know it's a car, you know what kind of car it was, you know what color car it is, but you don't need to say all that. You know that it was a car and it's gone, it's here now, and then it was here for a second and now it's gone. You know what I'm saying? Hopefully that made sense. But when you learn to detach things, it makes your life a lot better, in my opinion, because it's it's definitely helped me a lot because it helps me see things for what they are and, I, and I'm not so emotionally driven and, and in my feelings all the damn time. You know what I'm saying? Like, that that's just to me that shit is annoying like always being worried about the way that you perceive something and being so fixated on what you see and it's like dude stop selling yourself short and see the whole thing but in order to see the whole thing you have to attach or detach sorry you have to detach from that thing so that's all i got man try to practice detachment man Try to remove your personal feelings from things and situations and, and it'll allow you to see things much clearer and help you move forward in life and help you move on in life. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, yeah, that's what I got, man. Word of the day is detachment. <laughs> and with that being said, man, y'all take it easy. I'm gonna catch y'all on the next one, man. Peace.